This is my go-to recipe for a quick family pudding. It's delicious yet it's very very low effort. Uh, most of the time I make it with just apples but use any fruit you have at hand. I love fruit pies in general and this one is not just yummy it is as easy and quick as they come and you don't need to measure anything you don't need a mixer here you can just make it with a fork I have some uh, frozen apples which are from my tree and the apples freeze um, and keep frozen very well uh, freeze them on a tray in a single layer and then transfer to a plastic bag so oil well your baking tin and I'm using here uh, the self-raising flour, uh, the one which already contains the uh, raising agent. I'm also adding here mixed uh, frozen berries. They would add taste and color. Uh, actually pie is nicer when you mix uh, two fruits together. Even those um, hard supermarket plums, which you really cannot eat quite honestly, uh, they just um, work so well in this pie. So the fruit is straight from a freezer, so what I will do, I will stick it in the oven just for a few minutes to warm everything up. Um, by all means, I can skip this step. Uh, but it's not such a bad idea, the pie will bake more evenly. And over those few minutes, the fruit is in the oven, we quickly make the pastry. Normally, I don't measure, don't weigh anything here. The proportions are very loose, eggs to sugar, butter and flour. But for the sake of this video, I did weigh my flour um, and you will find all the measurements in the description uh, to this video. So egg, sugar and Greek style yogurt here. Uh, combine everything together we are not whipping anything up just combining melted butter another quick mix and now the flour goes in but uh, normally i simply dump dump it in from the pack directly uh, probably if you sift it first would be a good idea uh, be generous with the cinnamon here and just mix everything together uh, until you have no lumps um, just like a thick, uh, very thick pancake butter, uh, consistency uh, such as it would drop from your spoon. Uh, the fruit is warm to the touch, the tray is very hot, excellent. And now just spread your butter on top of the fruit, um, not necessarily covering it all, it's even nice if some of it poking through. And then just bake everything till golden color uh, at 180. It's so delicious. Enjoy. Mm -hmm.